Hey guys, and in this video I'm gonna show you how to make tape loop style ambient in VCREC with this new awesome Hornberg tape recorder. So I already built uh, this mini patch that uh, contains a um, few modules and I gonna describe it a bit. So I start from adding palette and tape recorder. So the reason to making ambient is um, allows uh, to randomize uh, the oscillator with all of those random modulators and then in case this recorder is always on in this tape uh, machine tape recorder so it needs to variate the incoming sound to get that nice uh, kind of stuff feedback ambient and make a short loop with this loop start and loop end knobs and set right bpm of course which can be controlled by the incoming cv uh, really lots of possibilities here so i start with a palette then add uh, a vca which is controlling by random module so the incoming audio not always would be the same level because it's um, pretty boring especially for ambient stuff and i try uh, i add actually book audio switch for switching uh, recording and unrecording state which controlled by this clocked module and the speed of the clock module is controlled by uh, this BPM output here sorry here it's tempo so yeah uh, I also add a um, few tape saturators to mimic the tape sound and all of this after um, module and the filter notch filter which is controlling by LFO so we get like this wow wow sound and in the end I add a reverb and wet control controlling a bit from this random instance of this random yeah, I also add, sorry, it's unusable right here. So I used chord key and add it to sequential switch. And the switch is controlling by transport output, uh, which switch to uh, plus five, minus five voltage, uh, depends on the playhead position forward or backward and also I got those hacks with micromap uh, both of them controlling uh, the fast speed this is speed when we press this rewind button and actually one of the rewind fast forward button is controlling by another micromap uh, which is controlling by uh, random module sorry LFO square LFO and random is controlling the fast speed so let's uh, and one moment uh, you can save anything you're recording at this moment because I believe this module works only with random access memories so we can bring the other the sampler a recording sample and record uh, for further use just remember when you close the rack next time you open it you lost everything 
so keep in mind uh, to keep your recording button on if you like to record something okay nice let's do erase tape procedure and let's start again from the beginning uh, the nice thing about palette in this setup you can switch between all of those modes and you probably know they all generate a different sound can also adjust uh, loop boundaries a bit and you can get those extra silence in case there are no recording sounds yet but keep in mind it's controlling uh, automatically so Every time it can be filled by the sound and you can feel and feel um, to infinity. I really like uh, the ability of hack of this controls. We also have a motor power, but I believe it works only when you press at this playhead, tape playhead. You can get really unusual results with this setup. You can reduce the loop again to get more constant result. Let's map the rewind button to hear what's going on with just a clear recording and looping back and forward. You can also disable your loop and the playhead should be stopped after reach the boundaries. But I still can't really get it. It seems to be a recording I really like that concept of short loop recording in case of using it for ambient stuff. Let's change to the percussion mode and record some noise. Yeah. Switch to the another one. So yeah, that kind of setup 
could be useful for creating background sound or city sound ambience uh, emulation or actually whatever you want uh, you can uh, also map all of those loop parameters but it's still complex to understand at least for me let's add another instance of simplister and record what we actually hearing right now the more motor power you add the more faster re release you will get so that was my uh, little experimentation with this awesome uh, Hornberg tape recorder and I hope you like the idea and you can get this patch for personal use on my Patreon as well. Uh, thanks to Zaire Norber for this amazing module. I hope this would get so many use in this by Visri Rack users. So thank you for watching guys and see you next time.